Gentlemen, it's time to jam your set in the Rama. As I said, jam your set in the Rama. I 
And we I, at this point in time, we present to you your host for the evening. Two, two star, star hosts. <laughs> Miss Crystalline Timothy and Mr. Jonathan Achaiba. All right. Good night, everyone. Pleasant good night. Trinidad and Tobago and all our international viewers out there. I am your host for tonight's show, Jonathan Achaiba, alongside with my lovely host, Crystal Ann Timothy. Good night. Good night. Good night, everybody. Good night to the listening audience. Good night to the viewing audience. Those locked on on Facebook, Jamia Set Facebook page, WAC 90.1. YouTube, WAC 90.1 Visual, Facebook, Locked On. Don't forget to like, comment, and share. All right, so Chris, we back here again tonight. Yeah, man, excited. The vibes looking nice. Yes. So, welcome everyone to Pan Moving Forward, Jam Your Set in the Rama. Who say no pan this carnival? Your mother what? what? <laughs> All right, so. To kick things off, we're going to have a word or greeting message from our Honourable Member of Parliament for Toko Sangre Grande, Mr. Roger Monroe. And I know, and I'm very confident, and I'm counting on you all to really bring it home to Toko Sangre Grande. Hi, this is Roger Monroe, MP for Toko Sangre Grande. Today, I fully endorse and support Pan Steronets, the original Toko band. Look out, other MPs and other bands, we come in to take the thing home. We would have won the prelim by 3,000. This time, jamming your set, 10,000, and we bring in the thing to Toko Sani Grande. So y'all look out, we will be victorious. Special thanks to Michael Mohammed Bookstore for the sponsorship in this great initiative. I'm asking other sponsors to come on board and give your support to the national instrument and the players. So my constituents of Togo San Grande, go on Jam Your Set Facebook page, share, like, and comment on Pan Steronet and give them your full support so that your help will help us bring it home to Togo San Grande. along in tonight's proceedings we're gonna have a short video from our main sponsor mr. Michael Mohammed I was approached by a very good friend Aquil Arendel and he asked me to help him fund this program virtually Pan jam your set competition I am a very passionate person about my culture. My name is Michael Mohamed and I'm the main sponsor for Jam Your Set competition. I am the proprietor of Mohamed's Bookstore 1988 Limited and Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company. Many of you may recall that in 2019 there was a, a, a primary and secondary Calypso Monarch competition. I also sponsored those prizes. I first met Aquel Arendal, when he approached me to publish a book on Pan. This book was supposed to come out in 2020. Due to the pandemic, we put it on hold. In 2021, he came up with a magnificent idea of Pan in Darkness, and we want to get them lighter. It's, it's the solar lights he wanted to introduce to the Pan Yards so with a cut force for the Pan industry. In doing so, he asked me if I would light up a pan yard. Immediately I said yes, as how I custom sponsor him for my culture. He said, well, I have an next idea, you know, pan. 
and he relate to me the facts about it. I say, okay, I enter education, virtual learning by books, virtual learning by pan, I am for that. So he, he tell me about the prizes, I say, I'm for that also. It's much more costly, but I am giving this to the nation. I love the idea that I will throw there. So at Carnival, we will still have a little jamming set. I also want to say thanks to all the bands that participate in this competition. And I wish you all the best of luck. And I wish this could continue throughout with your support. Initially, I sponsored the full prize. But due to the response we're getting from the band fraternities, I want to encourage them by telling them I am sponsoring a second and third prize also. All right, so we want to say a little special thanks to Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited in collaboration with Mohammed's Bookstore 1988 Limited. Special thanks, Mr. Mohammed, for you know being part of this initiative and really um, getting involved. Also, special thanks to Mr. Roger Monroe, the MP for Toko. It's really good, Chris, to see the MPs for the areas getting involved with the band and you yes, know? that was that was a delight to see when I saw the especially that one from Toko Sadi Grandi. He have a fire. <laughs> <laughs> So, at this point in time, Chris. So, with no further ado, we're going to go straight in to introducing our preliminary round winner, Pan Stereo Net. They were the winners of the preliminary round. We are in the semi-final round. Yeah. Of <laughs> we are in the semi-final round of Pan Jam Yes Set in the Rama 2022. So, here tonight, hailing from Kumana Village, Toko. The band is managed by Mr. Alfion Byron and captained by Akil Brown, who is also the arranger of this beautiful set we are going to hear tonight. Give them a warm welcome applause. Right. Panstereonets. Panstereonets.
Sir Kutley Ambrose, Courtney Walsh, Brian Charles Lara.
Jam Yasef in the Rama. Main sponsor is Muhammad's Bookstore 1988 Limited and Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited. Thank you, Mr. Michael Muhammad. We support you because you support us. Mr. Spear and the members of the staff from reaching out to the Steven community. And without further ado, I want to hand over to Mr. Spear who will give you a short address. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much. Rato, somebody we have to work with in the community who has been a community worker apart from being a part of the Cordes Steel Orchestra. Mr. Rindell. Other members of the Pant fraternity, members of staff of the member of parliament, office, any other distinguished ladies and gentlemen. The honorable member of parliament, Mr. Roger Monroe, wanted to be a part of this morning's um, distribution. However, because of parliament extending today, he's unable to be here but he wanted to identify with this initiative and thus we have the full complement of staff of the Member of Parliament office. We want to give the time facility the undertaking from the Member of Parliament office that we are ready, willing and able to work with you all not only in this initiative but initiative that will bring some relief and advancement to the community. It is important that we identify and be a part of that project. I was just discussing before this formal part would have started with the captain because they would have written a letter some time ago and we thought it was a larger grouping of people. But we'll make the arrangement whereby at least three representatives from the Paulette Steel Orchestra will be able to meet with the member of parliament. I want to personally also thank Mr. Arundel for working not only with the plant fraternity but with the member of parliament's office to ensure that we have some level of development. We don't want to talk a lot today except to say again that we are willing, able to work with the fan community for the enhancement of the fan fraternity in San Grande and the wider community of San Grande. We want to thank you all very much, members of the fan fraternity, for being a part of this morning project. And we wish you all God's blessing. Thank you very much. All right, so we're back. Um, so you all have seen the video with the hamper drive, you know, it's, it's really um, a wonderful thing to be able to give and help people, you know, in your society and your community. All right, so at this point in time, we would like to have some interviews done by our another host, Crystal. So who we have up? Well, love led me back to Mr. Byron, the manager. All right. So, Mr. Byron, tell me briefly about your little timeline or your big timeline with Pan Stereo Nets. In our, in our community, it had a lot of young children within the community that 
didn't have anything to do after school, it was just uh, by the sea. We didn't know any garden, so we decided to form this little orchestra. This orchestra was formed December 1995. And from that on, this band began to grow stronger and stronger. So you were the only manager that, that managed the band? I am today. only the only manager to date. So the band is yours or what? <laughs> I can say so. Oh, oh say the things, you know, say the things. <laughs> okay. So, um, your relationship with the players, uh, as is youth and is not of uh, older stature. Mm -hmm. Tell me about well, that. I is the grandfather of the band. Everybody, Mr. B, Mr. B, Mr. B. We have a love between every one of us, each and every one of us. We have a good relationship. All right. Thank you, Mr. Byron. You are welcome. Stephen. Henry, come to me. So Stephen, as the vice captain of the band, tell me what's your contribution and what you contributed to the band to bring it to this state here now. Um, I mean, you know, it's a lot of sleepless nights, you know, I was, later I was practicing, you know, just practice, you know, so. I think my contribution, my contribution basically, is a great one because, trust me, I real, I had a, them hours, like, them hours. <laughs> After 12, we practicing different. Yeah, really. your captain is a very clinical position in a band. Correct. Captain can go and sleep and lady players up, you know. Correct, correct. <laughs> you know this? Yeah. Right? So, what, what, where you see your band, Heading after this panorama here. Places I looking at how flying out touring, you know, gigging like madness. You know, that I, that I see in the future. And it think you all have the energy and the vibe and all what it takes to get a tour. Of course. My love. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Alright, Steven, thank you so much. Uh, Miss Crystal. I really like to jump in on your, on your fancy outfit and thing, eh? but um, I'll give Crystal a round of applause for her outfit. Hey, whoa! My host uh, looking nice tonight. Woo. A real van, how I finish. Anyhow, all this other fancy talk and all this kind of thing means nothing if the listeners, viewers don't donate, vote, share, like, press notification, comment do something because if you like the band like the band okay do this sit down and watch and smile and hey, the song is real good eh? and this is the band that came first in the preliminaries all right i agree so people outside here people outside donate subscribe like share press notification work in what again? Anything else? Anything donate you can pre again. press everything. Because this is your band. And donate again. Thank you. All right. All right. So remember to y'all like, share, comment, and donate. So at this point in time, we'd like to welcome Mr. George Caesar, a member of the band. And he has a little story to tell us about the Toko band, the original. Good night, everyone. Um, it's important for us to understand the story of Pan Stereonets as told tonight by members of the Toko Band. So the song and the choice of songs were very integral in us telling the story. That one overarching thing in the entire Caribbean that we agree on is the West Indies cricket team. So we had to start with that one unifying factor dear ladies and gentlemen, my dear friends, so that we could set that tone for the entire set that we are about here to do tonight. I am your humble host in terms of your translator to some of the things we're going to be doing, and without further ado, music.
All right, so we just want to come back on again and say a quick word. Um, Kenny, how are the numbers looking right now? We, we are at 0 0.68 percent. All right, so it's and a we start, would like it's to thank, we like to thank Glenda Bostic, who donated two days ago, and Patricia Walker. Thank you so much for your donations and your contributions, and for loving your culture and loving steel pan, and not just plain. Some people who say they love thing and you know what I mean. Thank you so much. All right. So once again, y'all listen. This is the band that mash up for the preliminary rounds, you know. So we encourage y'all to like, share, comment, and donate, donate, donate. That's how we're gonna get this thing rolling, right? So we back to the music again, Steronets, take it away.
Mr. Yatron, music sweet. Kenny, let me hear some numbers there. How are we looking? Right. Hmm. 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 I like a principal or a school. I have to go a little buff and then things start to move. You know it's good. You can't like the band and ain't like the band. You understand? So, ladies and gentlemen, right now, we are at 6%. All right, 6%. Well, you can't move, you know. Start to move. Mm-hmm. And, mm-hmm. We, and let me turn. Ovid Alexis. He said, thanks to the music. Really nice fan music. Fan music to the world. Thank you, Ovid. Sean Wharton. Lancelot Blizzard. Anonymous. Cynthia Alec- Angela Thomas. Winston Elcock. Corinne and Ian Ramsharan. Thank you so much. On the Cash App. We have two donations on Cash App. Thank you. Sheldon Francis and thank you Kendrick McLeod. Remember the Turkey Cash App is dollar sign Tigress 1011. It's running across the screen. Remember you can donate via the WAC WhatsApp phone, which is 766-4920. Call it, text it, and pledge your support and honor your pledge. Remember, this is how the band is moving forward or winning by your donations, by your shares, by your pledges, by your participation, your engagement. This is how we count in the thing. So don't love the band and say, oh God, it's something sweet and just sit down. And then when you realize, oh, wait now, they make? The band last week made 48%. I'm just throwing that out there. Well, so, we, want, we made that man, can you? Right. I feel we, we, we could we could talk about that. All right, so before our quick video from our main sponsor, we would like to thank some of our other sponsors. We have Sion's Bar, Sion's Variety Store, Hampton Place for Effective Residential Care. Pal, let's build it. You know, so the show wouldn't be it the way it is right now without all the sponsors. So thanks so much. And now a quick video from our main sponsor. Jam yourself in the Rama. Main sponsor is Muhammad's Bookstore 1988 Limited and Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited. Thank you, Mr. Michael Muhammad. We support you because you support us. Hi, my name is Nicholas Kanhai. I'm the councillor for the Electoral District of Barco West in the Penal Levy region. Yeah, I am Alan Sami, chairman of Penal Levy Regional Corporation. Okay, councillor Javed Mohammed, Otihiti Rosila. Councillor Derek Boyle, Monday City. Thank you for the opportunity and commend the initiative of Pan moving forward, the Sarandel, uh, for being given this opportunity to, to be here this morning with some of the pioneers in the pan movement in Faisalabad. I want to acknowledge the presence of Mr. Findlay uh, of Four Dimensions, which is based in Faisalabad, and of Mr. Bayer, who is well known in the pan movement. I've been a member of Parliament here for the last six years, and of course, the constituency of Faisalabad is well known for its culture, um, and the pan movement plays a very important role. And I, I do look forward to the opportunity to continue to engage and to strengthen with the, the pan movement uh, in Faisalabad. One of the current challenges that the fourth dimension band faces is the lack of a permanent home. And Mrs. Finley and I have already had some preliminary discussions in terms of how we will move forward to, to uh, locate and, and secure a space. Uh, we've had uh, quite a number of people, as a matter of fact, quite a number is a very uh, easy way to say it. But as of yesterday, my office, the Barco West Council's office, would have had to provide social relief in the form of food support uh, for 550 families just in my district alone. 
and would have contributed towards the Voice of Lupus Foundation. And uh, when uh, a call was made um, to assist the, the panis in the penal labor region, um, it could not go uh, without really trying our best to assist. All right, so we're back. If you're just joining us, we would like to let you all know that we are streaming on WAC Radio 90.1 and Jamia Setpan moving forward, Facebook pages. We are also on YouTube, and we want to encourage everyone to please like, share, and comment, and donate. And if you're unable to donate, that's all right. Share the video, because you might, you might know someone who will be willing to donate, all right? So, at this point in time, we want to just give a little shout out to our main sponsor, Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited, in collaboration with Mohammed's Bookstore 1988 Limited. Thank you so much again for our sponsor and for everything that you're doing for us. At this point in time, uh, we're waiting for the band to come back in and we're going to do some interviews. In the meantime, we'll also like to thank Sion's Bar, Sion's Variety Store. Pal, let's build it. Thank you so much for all your sponsors. So, a little bit about our show, and we like to know, you know, what you think. So, comment on the, on the live, tell us what you think about the show, and you know, just keep that the, the donations coming. Kenny, what, what do you think about how are we looking right now with the donations? How, it, um, um, we come in, we are coming in, we are still at six percent, and we thank all of you who donate. Those of you who we know some people can't donate, we understand that. But those of you who are sitting down and loving the music, you know, do what you have to do. If you like the band, do what you have to do. All right? All right. Yes. So, Chris, on to you now. We're going to take in a little bit of interviews again. So, you know, part of the whole production is not just performing playing, you know. We want to get to know so many members of the band. And as you can see, this band is full of a lot of youths. We are so, so happy to see that. You know, it's, you, you could safely say that the future of Pan is definitely in good hands. All right, Chris, so. So, Pan Stereo Nets, a youthful, youthical bunch. So, Nikisha Daniel, come here, mommy. Right. So, the band is youths. How you just cope with that? Well, considering um, some of them, most of them is my age, it's easy to get along with each other and speak to each other and communicate with each other. And because of that, we grew together as a family and our, become, our bond became stronger because of that. And I feel as though that is what's important. Great. Okay. So what motiva motivated you to start playing Steve Banner, are you from a musical background family? I specifically am not from a musical background, but I saw people in my school play Panorama and I, it intrigued me and I <laughs> wanted to play as well. So after I played the first Panorama with my school, I just fell in love with the pan and I just continued after that. Okay, so the first time it was difficult or it was hard? It take long to get the music? No. Nah. True. <laughs> How long you take to get our music? Me, well, um, I think the first time I played, um, um, they gave me the wrong fan and I had to learn about this whole song that exact day, the morning of the fan, remember? And I get it. This band full of skill, 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 people, boy. All right, Nikisha Gill, thank you. Aisha. You're another youth in the band. What makes your band unique from other bands? Um, well, I would say what is make our band unique is that we, the family aspect of the band. Everybody close. You could, um, we could always go to each other. Nobody will judge each other. We just help each other. We could point out each other's downfall without anybody feeling that type of way. So that we could help each other grow. 
And we grow closer with that now. So I would say the family aspect of the band would make it unique. Wonderful. <laughs> um, what advice will you give to youths coming into steel band that are interested in steel band? Well, um, the steel band does take a lot of focus and a lot of time. So I would say you have to um, balance. Balance is key. You have to balance, try to balance school with the pan and everything else in life. Now. It does take a lot of time, so you have to learn to balance it with everything else going on. Well done, Nikisha. Thank you. Yeah. Aisha? Yeah. Right. Oh, what is the Daniel? I say that twin, yes? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Chris. So I don't know about you, but how you used to balance school and, and pan long time? To balance it, boy. Um, no, we had to balance it. See uh -huh. the arranger that we have. Oh, that's <laughs> Mr. Guppy. Oh, good. You don't balance with it. <laughs> and he does see that's 20 the plane or the pan with the school. So you have to like a school if you want to be in pan. He don't play. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good to see the youths and I'm um, really um, taking the pan serious and the school work as well, too. You know, so yeah, and they're answering flute. Yeah, yeah, and the plane. The answer in the plane. This is a bunch. Of, anybody going UV here? Nobody? Oh, yeah, future, good future, future, future UV graduates. Keep up the good work. Keep up the good work. So right now, we want to encourage you, everybody to like, comment, share, donate. Go to the sites, Jam Your Set page on Facebook, YouTube Visual, WAC 90.1, WAC 90.1 on Facebook. Like, Comment, share. share. That determines our winners. So we're looking like stereo. That's right. The jam again. Yeah. All right. So at this point in time, we want to say a quick word again to our sponsors, Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited, in collaboration with Mohammed's Bookstore 1988 Limited. Thank you so much for your sponsor. All right, Chris, so it's back to the music. Stereo Nets, take it away. Words are useless when things are known. Music.
from Juna Puna. I think I need your hair for this one, boy. Ooh. All you have is sweating with that, boy. Somebody in the back say, Anko. Anko. <laughs> Will we take it again? Run it again, Dada. Sweet Lilith. Yeah, yeah, run it again. But before we run it again, Kenny, let me hear them numbers, how it looking now? Oui. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Oh. We are, we are at 10.67 percent, right. and we have started to move. And let's thank, let's thank Christopher Steele, Eileen, and Anonymous. Thank you so much for understanding what is going on, for appreciating these young people. If you appreciate these young people, do what you have to do: share, like, notificate, subscribe, do whatever. Don't let the band finish playing. You see, you know, I really like them, you know. You know that? Don't be no part-time lover. Come through hard. All right? Nice. Fix up. All right. So, man, we taking it again one more time. Yeah, we want... Yeah, man. But they had the whole background jumping. There we go.
time you set in the Rama main sponsor is Muhammad's Bookstore 1988 Limited and Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited. Thank you, Mr. Michael Muhammad. We support you because you support us. Extends uh, a plea for assistance every year, for example, to Panorama. We of the Pinar Devi will make available one of our big trucks to transport the pans to Port of Spain and back. So we are committed to it, we are committed to multicultural development. Especially in our communities uh, um, that fall under the, the Sipara Regional Corporation. And I'm happy to see that men. Um, such as um, the leaders of Deltones and Diatonics take the mantle in helping the youths to understand art and to learn more about it and to actually perform the art. That is something that, that should be applauded. And um, in moving forward, this Paris Corporation will definitely help in whatever way we can, with whatever resources we have to assist these groups within our, our region. And, um, in our own region, we have um, two um, orchestras. We're very proud of them, in Pina Mon Diablo and in San Diego, in Pina. Yeah, both Pali Harps and Funkadelics are Pinal based, uh, or I should say Pinal Debe based, because all of Pinal Debe will claim credit for the contribution they've been making. Well, in terms of the involvement with the pan fraternity, um, even growing up, I mean, pans are part of the culture, so the always, pan is always around. But um, when I came into the corporation in 2013, when I really got more involved with the pan through the Sapphire Fe Festival, as it's known now, um, with both the Gatonic and the Tones, who play an integral part in the, the Sapphire Fest, the, the, the steel in motion, that kind of stuff, and it was a very, very Powerful initiative, to use the word. Um, at the corporation, we have always been and there always be willing as much as possible to assist the Pan fraternity in Separia. We, we know that um, the work that they are doing, the tonic, and both their tones in terms of training the young pan panists and other community work that they have been doing. So we are always willing to help and partner with them. I'm very happy that that, that the, the, the Plan body has taken initiative to reach out to the smaller community. Donating is easy and very secure. Just navigate to the WAC channel on fundmetnt.com. Choose the campaign or shoe you would like to contribute to. Go to Donate Now. Enter the amount you want to donate. Check it twice. Enter your first and last name. Enter the email address twice. Then navigate to your country's flag and add your phone number. Then enter your credit card number. Enter the CVC or security code and confirm. Once confirmed, write a brief message and or select anonymous. Hit continue. Then confirm and pay. You should see a success banner and receive an email. Check the amount in the email and make sure that's what you intended to send. And that's it. Thank you and congrats for being a true culture warrior. Stand firm for your culture. We are Culture Crazy. Alright, welcome back everyone. Um, so you have just seen our tutorial video on how to do the donations. So once again, we encourage everyone to please like, share, and comment, and donate. And if you're just joining us, we are streaming live on Facebook, on Radio, Walk Radio 90.1, on, on Jam Your Set, Pan Moving Forward page. Also, we are also streaming on YouTube. So Chris, it's that time again for our interview. Yeah, yeah. Um, one thing. We end the semi-final round of Pan Jam Set 2022 Band Number Two, Pan Stereo Nets hailing from Kumana Village, Toko. So I'm going in with Shannon Henry. Hi, Shannon. Hi, 
Shannon. Hey. How long have you been playing fan? I have been playing fan and the whole approximately 10 years or so. With this band only? No, with this band, probably like eight years. All right, and the next two was which, which band? With G Notes. Oh, G Notes, another small band. Yes. All right. Okay, so what are the challenges you face in and outside of the pandemic with regards to the steel orchestra? Well, some challenges would be, firstly, not being able to play Panama, or God, we miss Panama so much, the vibes, everything. Everybody. Yeah, so another challenge would be um, not having time to do it because a lot of us are children and we're in school who have work, you know, finding the extra time to put in the extracurricular activity does be a challenge sometimes. So you're not you are the oldest player amongst the youths in the band. What motivated you to play pan? What motivated me to play pan would be my father. He used to play pan from since he was little with numerous bands. And I was like, I always wanted to play pan. Like, that's so cool. And, you know, it was a role model to me. So I decided, why not one day go to him, go with him to the pan tent. And that was when I just fall in love. Okay, Shannon. Thank you. <laughs> Jason Balgaru. Can I? Can I? <laughs> yeah. Sure. Yeah. You taller than me, no? <laughs> nah, 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 nah. You can't be from back. You can't be from back. Nah. But you? Big for that age. Well, he didn't talk or... <laughs> <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> I agree. I agree. So, I don't want to call it age, but seeing the age that you are, I ask that girl, what advice you have for youth like yourself coming into pan stereonets? Well, music is a thing that's take well. Well, number one, is discipline. You had a hard discipline and patience and them kind of things. But my advice to the youths and them who want to be a musician, you have to push yourself real hard and thing and focus on the music, you know, balance your time and them kind of thing and push, just push. Yeah. So as the youngest player in the band, what are the strong points of this wonderful steel orchestra? Strong points. Hmm. Um. Crits? Is Crits? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Zakiel? Yeah. Shannon? So you think that the, the entire band, that is the strong point of the band itself? Yeah. All right. Thank you, darling. All right, Chris. Ooh, my mic loud, boy. Hey, you'd like to put that mic loud on me, you know? So I think so far, with this band today and last week, we realized something they had in common, you know, is the love. The love between all the members and, and you know, like a family. You know, and um, like what the guy was saying us now there, hard work, dedication, you know, is what, is what will, will carry you all forward and in balancing your work and your plan. It shows in the music. Yeah, it shows. It shows you can see the discipline, music. how they play in, you know. So, one love, you know, that's what, we, that's what we want. So at this point in time, we're going to take a few minutes just to thank our sponsors, Sion's Bar, Sion's Variety Store, Hampton Place for effective residential care. Let's build it. And also our main sponsor, Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited, in collaboration with Mohammed's Bookstore 1988 Limited. Right, so we want to thank everyone who joined in on and for the sponsors. And if you're just joining us, please like, share, and comment and donate. All right, Chris, I feel it's time to get back to the sweet, sweet sounds of Pan Stereo Nets. I lost for words, I just burst my ear, Belna. Ooh! Oh, fancy now. I got a whole song. I like it. Oh, good, you like the outfit course of the seats tonight. I'm going to make my feel like going on, going on, buying some more. You close now, 
<laughs> All right, Quan Story Nuts, take it away.
Dang there. Dang 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 dang. June from Juna Puna. What are we talking about? Sweet. 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 Sweet.
Let me hear the numbers. Let me hear the numbers. Wow, before we go to the numbers, eh, I have a I have a request or a, let me read it as it come. All right. All right, let me read it as it come. Good evening. I would like to remain anonymous. I will donate fifty dollars if they can play. Can we talk again? Yes, sir. Yes. That's a round of applause, you know. You know that. All right. <laughs> All right. So before we get that, can we talk again? Encore. Mm -hmm. Let us encourage everyone, please, to donate. Share, like, and comment. And if you're just joining us, we are on Walk Radio 90.1 and Jam Your Set in the Rama on live on Facebook pages. Chris. And if you're now joining us, remember that in the semi final round of Jam Your Set. In the Rama 2022, like, share, comment. That determines the winners. I don't you see that band behind me. <laughs> you think heating up right now? All right, <laughs> so we're taking it. Kenny, what's the song? Can we talk? Remember, we are now at 15.62. All right, yeah. <laughs> moving sweet, All right, All right, stay in it. Yes, sir. All right. That, all right. that took us. Oh, God. The, hey. That took us. The music so sweet. I, I do know that. Uh, <laughs> My clothes down. I, yes, sir. I forget about who said show and thing. Yes. Jonathan, I close. Mr. Was, Jonathan, yeah, we are now at 17.87%. Ah, yeah, yeah. We look good. We look good. And, 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 
And we have coming in from the WAC pledging phone. We have a pledge from Shakira. Thank you, Shakira. Ian Ramsden, thank you. Somebody said the band is outstanding. And that's Patsy Joseph on her birthday. She said you're playing tunes for your birthday. Yes. Yes, thank you, Miss Mary. Miss Mary Dorset. Thank you so much. And we have some cash up as well. Jennifer Coca, thank you. Rayton, thank you. Oh, who else? Wow. So, ladies and gentlemen, remember, this competition is judged by donations, like shares, interaction. You know, you have to interact, you have to say something, you have to do something. So, please don't just like the thing home. Like it on Fundme TNT. Like it on Facebook. Like it on YouTube. And that just took us to 20.12%. Right. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Ms. Glenda Joseph and Terence McBurney. Thank you so much. Ban, mm -hmm. you see that last set Ole play before? They bring, ah, yeah, the yeah. They bring the fire. I'm waiting yeah. for that again sometime. Eh? We come remember right. that. We come remember that. Nice. So before we bring the fire, we gotta say a little thanks you know, to our sponsors. So we have Sion's Bar, Sion's Variety Store, Hampton Place for effective residential care. Pal, let's build it. And our main sponsor, Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited, in collaboration with Mohammed's Bookstore, 1988 Limited. Thank you, thank you so much for being a part of our whole show and letting us be able to bring this for the entire world to see. All right. Uh huh. Today's his birthday, and we're going to give him a forward. Plus, everybody birthday in China, that matter of fact, in the world. Let me give you a last small thing. Ah, boy. I tell you, it's really love in this place, you know. It's love in this place. Stereo net, are you ready to bring the fire? Are you ready? Well, you keep the donates going, huh? Why not, man? Why not? Where we go? Just don't fall. When I say wheel, I mean big grip. You want to pick it up? Fine, stone.
Ladies and gentlemen, our church service today, our scripture shall be taken from Kitchener chapter 4. Verse 2. And he says, my dear friends, they can't play pan. They tell me so. Thou countryman goeth back to Oku. What they did not know, our pan is sweet. And the crowd, my ladies, my dear friends, brothers and sisters, the crowd goes to the Toko Beat. A cappella. A, ca a cappella want it. A cappella. scripture had said my dear friends that toko ban we see it in history before harriet tubman martin luther king hugh masikela rosa parks and others these are people that went through insurmountable odds they climb mountains and jump off a cliffs to be able to do and bring to the world the message that they were sending and that is the story of the Toko Band that they different. That song that was immortalized by the late great Alvin Roberts. Look at Foresight. So long he sang that song. He sang that song a long time. But what he was able, able to capture is the plight of 85% of the fraternity. Plenty of people had no lights and water. He sing about that. Yeah, but, but, but this, this Toko Band. This Toko Band fired the, the, the vehicle of youth and the vehicle of upliftment. That, that's what we're using. So, so the care beat pan, they tell me that go back to Toko. No, we are going back nowhere. Today, today, tomorrow, and forever. This Toko Band standing up to everything. We go take the youth and we, we, we go get them purpose and direction. That's what they stoke a here for. So, so we can't be bad and what? Who say, who, who tongue ban is to say that we, 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 who, who, what, 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 what? 
Ladies and gentlemen, that is the scripture. So this service tonight, yeah, we just wanted to touch so, so that they could see we heart, the heart of the Toko band. And as we went through the different things, I hope we were able to please you, to bring you relaxing music, to give you an insight of the plight of the Toko band. Ladies and gentlemen, pan to the world! section is panorama is what kind of thing going on here man yeah mix up i, I get a shocker i had i get a shocker my life here tonight we are preaching yeah we are a uh, pastor wow, i feel like i was back in sunday church again yes <laughs> amen amen, amen. <laughs> for that so kenny let me so get some numbers we are at 25.29 percent all right all right and climbing. So we can there, we can there, we can there. And we have, we have cash up. We have cash up. We have, wow. Tilly and Grace Dutton, thank you so much. Ray Thorn, thank you so much. Jennifer Coker, thank you so much. On the pledges side, wow. What? Man, just say what? <laughs> Efron Saret, thank you so much. Mr. What? Thank you so much. All who people who feel that they need to contribute, and they wait until after, or they wait until when, you know, you might wait too late. The time is now. The time is now. The band is here. Do what you have to do. Once you're enjoying it, do what you have to do. If you can't, we understand the times, and you can't. But if you know in your heart that you can, and you sit down storming, just remember, it's the band from Tokyo, eh? they come from far. Do what you have to do. 
Okay, Mr. Jonathan. Yeah, this is your original Toko Banner. All right, so before we have a quick video from our main sponsor, we want to also thank Sion's Bar, Sion's Variety Store, Hampton Place for effective residential care, and Pal, let's build it. So, Chris, we're going to take a little short break with our ad, and then we're going to come back with some more fire. Jam is set in the Rama. Main sponsor is Muhammad's Bookstore 1988 Limited and Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited. Thank you, Mr. Michael Muhammad. We support you because you support us. versatile um, instrument um, and, but I've not personally had the opportunity to, to play the instrument but it's something I do, do look forward to. In right. fact on the many occasions that I've had cultural and other events at the constituency office um, we've, we've always had the instrument you know, being played as, as part of our culture. I'm very really happy to be associated with this venture and I can tell you that I've had an early experience with panda that I can play and to deaf I think. <laughs> but I grew up in San Fernando and all around me would have been sick bands. Uh, so I had experienced it full sun. I recall as a young fella pushing Steve Band because I can't play it um, on Carnival Monday and Tuesday night. Because in those days the band used to be on the talking right. And then over the years I People can take it as a trade, they can take it how they want, right? For me personally, as I said before, music is a mission, not a competition. But we are in a competition. So I am fully confident that we have what it takes that can take us to the top, is we understand that winning is our behavior. So you say the competition is an opportunity to take us from the slumber we was in, right? And you just wait. You just wait and vote for good music. I just said earlier, vote for good music. You have the confidence that we can to bring this championship home. My name is Alfian Byron and I'm the leader manager of Pan Sterenel Steel Orchestra. This band also known as the Toku Band. This band was formed in a little village of Kumana on the north coast on the 10th of December 1995. We have been taking part in all events in Panorama and other events. Right now we are preparing for a repertoire competition sponsored by Pan Moving Forward and Mr. Mohammed Bookstore. We are so grateful that we can have a competition at this time while Pan is being dead. So Mr. Mohammed, we supporting you because you supporting us. Then for the Toko Massive, the Sandy Grandi Massive, you know the whole Northeastern Massive. Um, um, St. Andrews and David, the whole county, right? So, we're the only steel band in this area that will be representing the art form, right? So, when you hear any song in the background, we come from this country, steel band, um, Kitchener, Lord Kitchener, the great Lord Kitchener, sang the song, you know, in, um, in honor, right? Of the work that we do in the Toko Sandy Grand area. Unfortunately, we have a lot of challenges. Um, COVID, of course, is one, but beside COVID, you know, we have... Uh, infrastructural challenges you know we have challenges financial um, challenges as you can see we practicing in the um, dark right now you know so that is one of the things we definitely would be looking to get some kind of support my brother Roger Monroe right you're doing great work thus far right but I'm asking if you could you know still come in you think a little bit and help me build it a little faster and I can't wait for COVID to subside nobody knows when that time will come you know I also want to um, say at this point in time condolences to the great Alexander. You know, I am a student of him, you know, um, and his work. Remember, vote for the Toko Band on the Jamia set in competition. As to as you do anything, I speak to everybody. We have a for the task for the and the movement that's going on that will happen after this. 
And I call my friends, family, community to like, share, comment, and keep the fan moving forward. So we're back with Pan Stereo Nuts. So I, I now find out something, Chris. This band have a competition running for the person who brings the most likes and shares and comments. And they have a very nice special gift box with, with uh, skincare products and all these things. So if all you actually come on and like and share and comment on this band, and all you win that surprise box, all you're bring it for me now. I want to see, I, I, I could do it a little lotion and a little something. But we want to encourage everyone, please like, share, and comment on our Facebook pages, on YouTube, and donate, donate, donate. All right, so right about now, Chris, we have some interviews again. <laughs> Eeny, meeny, mighty, bo. I call it Chris. I call it Chris. But you know, literally, these two last interviews, I really don't have come by me now, upon. Good. Me, I do good long time. Chris, we tired, boy. We running time. for me so no far. No COVID-19, you know, you had a social distance, you think. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, I have no question for you. Tell me about your musical history. Tell the world about Crick's multi-talented Fleming. Well, um, good night to everyone on the social media platform, on the live stream, on the jammy set competition. Um, it's a short, well, bio on my history. I've been playing fan for the better part of 23 years now. Um, I arranged for Desperado's youth band, the state side, for the senior band, um, Korea Polyphonics, a lot of bands. Um, it's too much to just name or be top. At the head, yeah. Even that, yeah. Um, I started music when I was 12 and I never looked back. My parents was always behind me to do well in school and my reward was to play pan and go in the music room and do stuff around music now. So I was always like driven towards being a musician from since I was like six years old until now. Um, well, I turned 29 on Friday and that was it, yeah. Big people thing. Yeah, that was, that was it. But this experience here was a magical one. I'm actually wrong. They suddenly called me and they're like, hey, yeah, you're getting this thing, boy. And I just get up and I go. And since then, for the past three weeks, I've living in Toku. <laughs> living. My mother looking all over for me, calling my phone and all kind of thing. But she know, yeah, yeah. I am a mother, no, I don't have no troublemaker. I was always on music and I'm one thing now. I never know you as a troublemaker. Never, yeah. never. Well, yeah, and it's a great experience. Like, share, vote, comment. For Donate. the Toku band. Donate. Cry that up to 50%, 100%, 100%, a yeah. billion percent. Cry it up, 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 up. All right, and, Yeah. Well, big up my father, who was an, inspir an, uh, an influential person in me, arranging in steel pan. Like, in youth band, he always moved me around from this band, from tenor to seconds to chords to bass, and I was wondering, like, why not? And it's when I get older, I realized that he wanted me to be an arranger, and he realized that I wanted to do that now. So big up my father, Nigel Fleming Sr., a.k.a. AKA Boysen, from Death Rattles. All right, so yeah. Yeah. So uh, that is it, and well, uh, Akil, up Thanks now. Thanks so much, Kirk. Thanks yeah. so, so much. <laughs> well, I don't call him no Akil. I don't call him no, no sniper. I just call that boy Cecil Boy. <laughs> Easy. Easy, Mr. Cecil. Good night, people. Love, respect, manners, and more. Same thing, musical director. I'm putting a hand on to your name. Musical director, same as Crooks, tell us about your musical timeline and tell us about your experience with Pan Stereo Nets because you seem to have a real passion for this little band here. 
Yeah, um, so uh, my musical experience is really one similar to that of Quicks, you know, but it was uh, uh, the, 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 um, the strategy used by my father was different from Quicks. My father was a real general, you know, so he sold you. He sold you, I'm up in the thing now. You know, beside that, I'm also the nephew of the late Herman Guppy Brown. I am the nephew of Kenneth Guppy, Tony, and so many others, you know. So I really born in this thing, you know. Long Strictly. before, long before I come in that. So Kessel and I talk about how she would have to balance school. Right? She came under the regime of Kenneth Guppy too. So, you know, it's that kind of discipline. And my father was a lieutenant in the army. When I said the army, a not Hitler, the... Hitler, lieutenant. Yeah, well, Hitler, you know. <laughs> he wasn't playing. He wasn't having it. You know, discipline is the order of the day. Balance is the order of the day. If you hear some of the youths, you know, they, 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 they know this is where we are about, you know. Yeah, um, my musical, musical um, timeline. timeline, you know. As I say, from little boy, we come up. We had a family band, you know. One of the first bands I played with is um, J Notes, probably at the age of seven or eight, you know. Um, then we, we went to, we went, me and my siblings went to Cordets on that jet. I remember jet, every time he coming up the road, just the, the boss, every time he come in to put on the music by Cordets, he had to pass by before to make sure we in the pan yard. And none of us was past the age of 12. Yeah, he never seemed to want to do the music without us now, you know, for that period of time, you know. So, I mean, um, and just keep coming, 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 and do a lot of work. And then I get um, the biggest musical influence. I would say I get to be honest, I gravitate towards Zander, Clive Zander, style of music, you know? Big so one. everybody who know me as a hustler know I would have been hitting 15 to 20 bands up on my season, you know? And that was, my, that was my gig, you know? That was my gig. And until um, uh, I bounce up, um, Akinola and them, Akinola Senan and you know, um, Deltones massive, you know, but I'm not junk. And I never look back from there in terms of music. You know, the music really whole man, I started to pay attention to it. But it's only five years ago, I started my career as an arranger. By the very first band that I played, Panama, across the Panama stage with a, a little band in Grandi called J Notes, AKA Jokey Notes, you know, the band is a band where I come Last in the Panama, due to a lot of difficulties and challenges, you know, the band been through, they don't have a home. A lot, watch me, basically the, the story of the Toko band is the story of 95% of the bands in Trinidad and Tobago. You understand? And even in St. Vincent and Grenada and, and, and the struggle reel, the struggle reel with pants, so the people who are looking on, you understand, all they need to, or we need to continue supporting and pushing the art, you know, because they follow the maths. Majority of them youths and them here, you understand? If we don't have this in our community to help them balance themselves, it's tragedy more than it already is. You know, so what we have to do is, you know, just keep, keep pushing. I you know um, all the community leaders, the real community leaders, I will tell all you something. If all you think all you just be locking the monster outside, them, them same children and them all you just thing and all you find a little indiscipline and thing, if all you do make an effort and make a step towards them, you go come back and bite here. Yeah. You can't have a proper business in your community. You can't do nothing progressive in your community with that level of negativity. So it's really important for, you know, everybody to say that we guide each other and them the right way. We have to guide each other and them. So they talk about sacrifice. I just sacrifice with them. They just sacrifice with me. You know, the community where we are from, you know, they understand what we are up against. You know, and um. You know, basically, the struggle real, and we intend to go to the end with it, you know? Yeah, um, Cricks, um, when we heard about the competition, you know, I asked the members, because it's two years now, we didn't get to do anything. I asked the members if all they want to, you know, go in the competition, I go like, yeah, yeah, everybody was excited for it. You know, and one of the many things that we do is we try to encourage agriculture and different things in the community, and Cricks happen to be in my community, doing some agriculture. You know, doing some agriculture, and I heard about it, and I said, but wait now, Cricks and Grandy by me? Right here? I said, I'm gonna call him up one time, and I call up Cricks, my brother reach over the next day, and three weeks, we put together the set, you know, juggling, school, work, you know, and the full work. So I just wanna commend um, 
my team, I want to commend my community Toko, Sandy Grandi. You know, I want to commend my, commend my MP, you know, my parents, everybody who bring, who, who was a part of this journey, you know, and most of all, you know, at this point in time, the support is needed in a real way, right? Like, share, subscribe, vote, donate, donate, donate more, donate more, 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 let him on, easy money, send it over, right? to build this community and build this movement. Pan movement forward is a real thing. Yeah? Yes, man. Thanks, Akil. You're welcome. All right. So a lot of history you could see in this band. A lot of royalty, you know. So we're we happy to get a little touch of the history and what's happening. All right, Kenny. How are you numbers know, looking so far there? We are. We are at 28.89%. Look at that. And let's say quick thank you to Ronald Matthews, Marilyn West, Fulmin Makano, Gregory Branca, Courtney Johnson, Wendy Drayton, Onika Kaur, and Anonymous. And then we went to 29.34 while I'm speaking. All right. Alistair Thompson, thank you so much. And we have some donations on the pledges. Thank you, Shakira. Oh, Shakira, who say I put in 25 more to make 100. Thank you so much. Good night, drinks, Andrea. She pledging to span steronets. And right. Yep, that's it there. Thank you so much, all the people who contribute and enjoying the show. Those of you who enjoy the show and not contributing, all I can say to all is SMH. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right. <laughs> All right, so thank you so much, everyone, for donating. And remember to like, comment, and share. All right, so, Chris, I feel it's time to jump up, Sasha. No, you know. I, I ready uh, to jump up. Yeah, yeah, stir, yeah. So, let me make me yeah, jump. It, it had to be fast. Is it slow? No, no, no. It's slow. Time was before. Cecil was boy. Cecil boy. Wait to see. Action is jamming. All right. Let me go. There we go. Myron, he was standing up looking so proud in the corner there. Yes, man. He happy, contented. All right. Let's go, go Pan Stereo Nets.
right, all right. Oh my God, Chris. I only hope Kenny has room for the toko bottle because they're not going back home. <laughs> they have room for the toko bottle, Kenny. Kenny, hit me some numbers there. We are at 29.34%. All right, so we're coming along, man. And we thank Alistair Thompson and Anonymous. Now remember that the FundMe TNT site for the Pan Steronet will be up. So you can always continue to donate and contribute and do all the interactions as you would like to do. As we know you will have it in your heart to do. So thank you all so much for who did the pledges. Remember, honor, the, honor your pledges. And those of you who did the cash up, thank you so much. And um, talk about Tokuban. Great job. Great job. Great job. Excellent job. Man. All right. So what we want to do now is say a little thank you to our sponsors. Our main sponsor, Caribbean Tutorial Publishing Company Limited, in collaboration with Mohammed's Bookstore 1988 Limited. Also, our other sponsors, Sion's Bar, Sion's Variety Store, Hampton Place for Effective Residential Care, and Pal Let's Build It. All right, so, Chris, who we have? We're going on for next week. Right, so before we touch on next week, Panstereo Nets, we have about seven days to continue liking, sharing, and comment if you all want to keep this band in the position that they are right now. About seven days to continue to like, share, and comment. And donate. And donate. And donate. And donate. And I say donate. <laughs> Also, just a reminder that Panster Next also have their own little competition going for the person who brings in the most likes, shares, and comments. And they have a lovely special gift box with skincare products. So let's keep on voting and keep this band in the running for the finals. So, Chris. So for next week's Sunday, in position number three, we have the Facts and Us. They will be gracing the stage to give us their set. And it will be the same process. Like, share, comment, and... Donate! <laughs> I love all of you. All right, thank you everyone for tuning in tonight. Good night, good night. Thank you, Trinidad, and all our international viewers. Stay safe, Trinidad. Mm -hmm.